Hello everyone and welcome back to our friend Torino Bar. And I thought the Cornates were mostly dead, but it turns out they seem to have a settlement out on these islands. So we're probably gonna have to go and deal with that eventually. But first, I wanna go and kill some vampires, because we got a really good opportunity to kill the faction leader here. And we do have to deal with them eventually, so I think we're just gonna go for it. Because I think we have a pretty good shot here. So yeah, let's just go... All right, we're not at war. Um, I don't think we're gonna call these guys in actually because they only have this and uh, I don't want them to go out and die honestly because I kind of just want want to have some dinos from them so we're gonna keep them alive and just go in like that. And that is gonna be a valiant defeat but I don't think it's gonna be like that because they mostly just have a bunch of skeletons and I'm not too worried about that. Although, their lord is a little bit spooky, because he is a legendary lord from, I think, from the lord pack that we... Well, if he's a legendary lord, he's definitely from the lord pack that we're playing with. So, he's got some spooky things. Well, Pestilent Birth is just a dragon thing. Staff of Domination, while good, is just an item. But yeah, he got, he's got Sycophant of Life, so he can do some really nasty damage to a living unit. And I don't know if there's anything else in particular. We got Circlet of Rotec. That's gonna give him, give him a bunch of uh, bonuses if he is close to death. Which, well, close to things dying. That kind of death. Which makes sense. Yeah, so he's gonna be a little bit spooky, but hopefully we can just uh, lure him over with maybe our lord and just get him into Archifier. He's also got this giant that I'm a little bit worried about, who's uh, carrying a very cool club made from Looks like a tree that just ripped out the the roots and uh, just made them look cool. But yeah, he's pretty strong, but uh, we should be able to kill him with just a bunch of shooting as well. But shit, that is a lot of melee attack and weapon strength. That's gonna be rough. But we are fighting in a downward slope here a little bit, so I think... Yeah, I think we're just gonna set up kind of here-ish, since it is uh, it is tapering out a little bit and getting a little bit flatter. So I think this is gonna be fine. Let's just make it a little bit of a chevron, so we can just cover our flanks a little bit, like so. Put some sea guards and just go. Just um. Go yin yang yin yang so they can buff each other. That's gonna be pretty good. Can we? Yeah, we can separate them a little bit because I would like to go kind of wide ish so that we can fit these archers in here nicely. And I guess we'll put that a little bit to the side so we can have uh, the bolt thrower. Actually, put, put the bolt throwers in the middle. I like the symmetry better this way. There we go. Perfect. Uh, you can be like group three. We'll go up and skirmish with you. You two are just in group one. You're gonna be group four, and you can be five. Because you got you got Vanguard, and you can start shooting. Well, you don't have a ranged attack, but you have Soul Quench that we can start shooting right away. And you can't quite reach from there, which is fair enough. But I don't think I want to move further up. I think that's good. Yeah, we're gonna go with that. We are gonna... Right, right. You still don't have a shooting thing, but you do have Flock of Doom. We can get five units there. We get the Lord, the Banshee, and a bunch of Skeletal Warriors, which is kind of nice. And just Soul Quench. Ooh, and there's... I don't think they're attacking. I think they're just running after our Cav here. Well, that's fine. Starting to heal Fredrik Van Hal. Well, get a little bit of a volley off. Actually, that's gonna heat right away. <laughs> that's wasteful. All right, let's uh, kite you back. See if uh, they want to go into our bolt throwers here. We can turn on the uh, the spread shot, and they should be shooting here. Terrible first volley though, <laughs> but it usually is. So let's just run you down the flank because they should start shooting here. We got another. Actually, shoot it at you. Just. Oh wait, no. Hey, that. Okay, good. He's got regeneration. That's so that would be a waste. Just shoot at uh, at the Lord. Make him at least heal it. 
It's gonna be fine. And yeah, you're gonna be thoroughly killed by just the bolt throwers. Yeah, so we'll uh, we'll ignore him until we can actually start uh, uh, start shooting him properly, because otherwise he'll just get a bunch of value from sitting back. And I guess I'm just gonna cut to when things starts happening, because I'm just gonna sit here and skirmish and shoot soul quenches at him until he ta attacks us. Oh, things are moving, so I think maybe he's attacking here. Actually, let's let's have him uh, go a little bit closer. Have him, because I think now we can lure him over. So yeah, just run down. You need to start shooting again, because I kind of felt like we were wasting ammo. But start shooting at him here. Let's get, uh, let's get another soul quench. Come on. Got it. <laughs> Run. Because <laughs> we are way faster than him. At least we should be. Yeah, we're, we're way faster. So pop the scroll. It's going to give us some speed and unspottable. And then we try to lose him. Oh, come on. Now we go around and have things shoot at him. Because we're going to see if we can get some blobs here. And everyone should be shooting there. Turn you around. Have you shoot over there. There we go. So are get let's see if they can if they're gonna do some blobbing here. No, oh, they're just setting up. All right. Well, I guess uh, I guess that's fine. Uh, we can even get some draining on you. Oh, right. We have a power power stone. We should definitely use that. So go and drain him. And I guess uh, we we'll wait for his reinforcement here. Because I think he's here. They have a tendency to blob up, so we're just going to do that. And he's just sitting there. <laughs> I think we broke him. <laughs> I'll take it. Look at this idiot. I thought it was going to start flying into our front line and we'll send in the characters. Oh, there he goes. Oh, because he found me again. <laughs> I think I confused him too much. All right. Oh, shit. Dodge. Dodge. Ah, oh, damn, that hurts. All right. Well, run you up the flank. And now they're attacking. Oh, and I think they're attacking you. No? All right, let's, <laughs> let's just pull him in. He is dodging a lot, though. But, all right. Let's just fight him. Oh, that hurts. But we can get ourselves a big heal here. And he should be going down to all the shooting. And here comes the rest of their stuff. Alright. Let's land him. Ow. Get ourselves a heal. And... Okay. You need to go and help over there. Probably send in you as well. Get a big... Helm of Discord here. Come on. Get in there. We need the Disco Helm. Okay, good. The Lord is dead, so how the hell did you get past? Oh, and you snuck past the... <laughs> you son of a bitch. Well, it's all right. They are crumbling already, so big helm of discord. You are terrified. All right, well, that's okay. We can uh, we can let you recover here. Let's get you in there. Get your healing, and we need to start flocking, flocking the dooms. Dooming the flocks. So get right there. That's a really good one. We can also get a chain lightning like right there. And let's go in and blind some stuff. So go in and fight you. Blind him. Let's heal you. Oh, wait. Whoa. Oh, wait. Right. He's in a different group. That's why I can't see him. Uh, can we grab all of the archers and just focus the giant? Because he is nasty. Let's drain him. You get on top of him. Let's get a heal. And we're holding pretty nicely here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's good. And we're just waiting for another chain lightning. We're waiting for more flock of dooms. The giant is going down fast. He's such a big dumb target. 
So we might have done a little bit of damage, but damn if he doesn't go down fast. Oh, one last hit. But it's not enough. So heal him. Let's get a flock of doom, like right there. Let's go and land and get a kinetic. Holy crap. Okay, there's skeletal scaremans. Scaremans, they scare me. The scaremen are in. Oh, well, let's get a kinetic blast. Just uh, to blind all of these and uh, chain lightning those guys. And I think this is gonna be army losses in just a second. So get some heals. More heals. Uh, heal on top of you. And yeah, we're gonna be fine. It's a pretty clean fight, I think. I like it. And we almost perfectly used all of our magic as well because we're out of reserve and we got six mana. Perfect for... Well, we can get an Earth Blood or an Apotheosis. Either way, let's heal up through Inabar a little bit as the army crumbles. Nice. That was a good one. It was pretty helpful though that the Lord just forgot to move and just stood around doing nothing. And they didn't actually get to keep much. They lost their most important things. Got to keep a grave... Oh, that's, that's the garrison. That's fine. We're gonna go and order us all that now. They did get to keep the Vargeist and some Black Knights, but other than that, they did not get to keep very good stuff. So, we're just gonna grab some money and influence. Is your only and, uh, this is don't think we can reach you, but I don't think we want to either. Because, uh, we just want to go and take this and, uh, oh damn, we lost 49 from that. Alright, that's fine. We're gonna loot and occupy this and, uh, we're gonna sit here and just enjoy ourselves. Could grab some... Oh, actually, this is gonna pay for itself so quickly. It's gonna be two and a half turns, and then it's just gonna be... Good, nice profit. And right, we're dealing with the Rebellion here, and then we're just gonna go up here. And you might be able to do some work along the edge here. But you are gonna need some more stuff from that. But we can get Lothan sea guards over here, so we might just give her give her some sea guards. I'm a little bit annoyed that we, well, since this got raised, we didn't get to actually get our cab. But let's upgrade you. Don't think we're gonna build much there. And oh right, we were uh, waiting for this or to afford that, but we can do that as soon as we get one of these convoys. So that's gonna be great. Oh, right. Also, something that bothered me when I was editing is uh, I never gave her the Ancillia that I said I was going to give her, which would have actually prevented at least one rebellion. So, yeah, I probably should have done that. So, let's grab a scout while we're at it. And... Oh, the Lord Ma Lore Master needs this. Okay, so give that what to the Lore Master. And I guess just give that to the scout. Do we have any items? Got a dragon helm and a trickster shard. Well, I guess spells. grab a dragon helm. Don't grab the trickster shard though. We should give that to... Speak. I guess we give it to her instead. Alright. So let's pass the turn. And I think we're alright from this. Because they, they're just really hurt. So I think we're good. Shall reach the Phoenix and throw. Tor Elithis wants... Ooh, trade. Sure. I'll, uh, I'll sell you some trinkets. It'll be great. And Elite Sailors of Ulthuan. And I think I just... I think I most of the time is gonna take uh, Love and Sea Guards. I guess it would be nice with one Elithmar chariot. But I like Love and Sea Guards. There's... Oh, shit! Alright. Well, we got a pretty good army here. Hopefully this isn't one of those with uh, a bunch of executioners and blackguards and stuff like that. Alright. So where are they? For the king. So I guess they're not attacking right away. Because they're not revealing themselves. Which uh, is a little bit promising, because that might mean we get to set up a little bit. Okay, pause. 
Where are they? Okay, never mind. They are really surrounding us. Got lots of shades. It's bleak swords and dark shards. All right. Well, uh, they are s they are exposing a lot of their a lot of their shooting here, though. So let's try to go around and hit some shades. Well, uh, rush them with you. Rush up with you. Send in you. Send in you. Let's run around with you. Run around with you. Just try to get on the flank. Come on, sit. Um, you can just. Actually, yeah, shades can definitely be beat shadow warriors. So yeah, let's uh, let's just have them stand back to back. We'll have you like, go back to back and back to back. And the phoenix, you're gonna go and poop on things. Oh wait, no, you're a you're a frost heart phoenix. You can't poop. Worst phoenixes. They can't even poop. Worthless. But really good charge there. Very nice charge. They do have some spares behind, but uh, I guess they can just work as an anvil for us. So let's pull you back a little bit. Hit the bleak swords. The phoenix guards are coming in, so let's try to disengage. We're gonna be fine. You're fine. We're getting in there. You're fine. And yeah, you should be able to do some damage to these shades. Let's pull out and pull out. Just avoid the spears a little bit because the Phoenix Guard and uh, and uh, White Lions can definitely deal with that. And you go and help out with the shades here. So yeah, I think this is gonna be pretty clean actually. Let's get you on the high, the high Beastmaster. It's gonna be fine. And yeah, you're about to break. And you should not last long there in melee, so yeah. Let's get you around, try to get you on the dark shards, but it's gonna be fine. Oh, and you should definitely focus on that, not try to push through. Yeah, crash into those dread spares. This is all breaking, excellent, excellent. We can grab everything and just rush them in there. Although the cab, we can go and help out with that, because we seem to need it. Send you in over there. Please focus them. And yeah, you're br you're breaking, you're breaking. Okay, there we go. So not too bad. It was pretty clean, I think. And very nice. Barely took any damage. We can grab some free money here. And they should be done soon as well. Oh, the Black Pit tribe is dead. I don't... I don't know where they were, so... Oh, wait, no, they're... They are the ones in the Empire. And yeah, we can just auto-resolve that. That is fine. You're not really gonna fight anything anytime soon anyway. And... Uh, oh, we got the rights back. And I think we might want to do this now, because both of our armies are kind of hurt. And it's not entirely that, though. It's mostly just I want to get rid of the corn corruption that is everywhere. Now that we've... Uh, Kind of gotten rid of corn here, but there's still a lot of corn corruption, so kind of want to get rid of that a little bit faster. And we do have plenty of money because we got like 20, 20k coming in in the la the couple of the coming couple of turns. So yeah, I think that's gonna be fine. Oh, can we reach you? No, but I kind of just want to kill you so you don't decide to just come and. Start burning some uh, stuff down. And uh, since we don't take attrition, we can just... Terms. Oh, shit. Look who's trying to take it. Oh, but we can just... Yeah, we can just order us all this. Perfect. Rebellion bodies. dealt with. Sweet. So, let's upgrade you. Upgrade you. I'm listening. And uh, I guess we should repair this because I do think we're gonna keep it at least for a. I mean, we're probably gonna keep it forever because we're just gonna make good money from this gold mine. I would like for these guys to have their own province, but I don't think I'm gonna give them this or probably not that either. Yeah, we'll see. 
I guess if they take this, we might sell these off just to give them a full Seven province so tower. they can get actual dinosaurs oh, and we can get some good recruitment. Oh, actually. Ever on. Never. There's this a lot of stuff place. and um, yes. should have probably ambushed further down there. But that's all right. And we're pretty much done with this. We are one level away from our own dragon. So that's sweet. I guess greater ward and the defense is kind of nice. Just make him a little bit tankier. Because right now he's... Well, he does have, have 20 ward save. So he is a little bit beefy. And he will be a lot beefier once he gets his dragon. But a little bit extra ward save and uh, speed and middle defense is not bad. And now I think we're going to go down casting yeah 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 yeah. so let's get foe seeker and you're almost on your eagle don't think i want you on the chariot but i do really want you on the eagle or at least the steed which you are on which is nice oh wait um actually i want to grab both of these oh wait though this is just chaos and it's basically everything evil except for vampires so let's actually do like that as i as i thought first magic in purest form and wait what what are we getting with you you haven't leveled a lot we could go down here because you do have a caster but i think no nah, i want to get to dwellers so yeah life bloom is fine we can just spam this actually let's get life bloom second Magic's unleashed. Get soul quench. And all right, we can build. We can build an outpost, but I don't really want skinks. <laughs> I want dinosaurs. So once you get dinosaurs or at least some kind of saurus for our front line, then I'm just gonna ignore you. How much uh, allegiance do we have though? Forty. Oh yeah. Okay, that's pretty good. So we can get lots of lizardmen units if we want to. Would you make of the Phoenix oh, King? Bretonians. Uh, yeah, sure. Non-aggression pact sounds great. And uh, that's a nice chunk of change. I like it. And they didn't see through my... My thing. Wait, why did I get a bunch of... Uh... No, it was not because I finished this. It is going to give us some... Some alright things. That's pretty good. And a little bit of money. Ooh. That's not bad either. Wound or kill. Oh, with assassination things. Hmm. No yeah, that feels a little bit unlikely. But, I mean, maybe. So, I don't know how much we're gonna keep using Illyrian Reavers. They are kind of nice, but they are do they do fall off a bit. This would be uh, Elithmar Smith and Grand Repository. Which one is that? Okay, it's... Yeah, it's this. I guess that's pretty doable. Because um, you are done in one turn. And then we'll get this to tear four. Which is fine. This is getting there. We should upgrade that though. So yeah, I think, I think we'll be alright. So let's get ourselves a couple of uh, Lothern... Why do we only have one? Oh, because we're not taxing. Well, we can start taxing this now, which is super, super nice. <laughs> uh, grab two of those. Start get, getting a couple of uh, sea guards and we'll march on that. I think we'll be just fine. And you still just have one unit. Hmm. You're gonna mess with our... Oh, we can tax you too now. Yeah, all right. So our economy is, a m is much better than I thought. So that's gonna be good. And uh, they kind of just didn't notice us, so we can go and take this, I suppose. Do they have a garrison or something here? Nope, doesn't seem like it. Whatever you... 
Alright, well, we can just auto-resolve that then. And I guess we should get some... Let's get some spell resistance on you. You're the most likely target to get drained. Although you're also flying, so <laughs> you should really have this too. Um, let's put it on the Lore Master instead. It's gotta be fine. And, oh, that is a lot of replenishment. It's not a lot of money though, and we're pretty alright on replenishment, I think. So, let's, let's occupy it normally. And uh, try not to take too too much control damage here. Good. So you're you're doing your thing. You're upgrading. You can almost get your cav stuff. So yeah, good. I guess uh, lower the upkeep for northern sea guards because we are we're probably gonna have lots of them because I like them a lot. And pass the turn. And Shadowed Plunderer. Alright, so... This is more reasonable. I think we can take this. The, um, the White Lions have really good AP, so they can do some pretty good damage against these guys. They do have a couple of Harganets as well. But our Source Masters are kind of on par with them. And Phoenix Guard are kind of on par with these guys. So I think we can do this. Because our Silver Helms can just annihilate their back line. We got lots of good shooting. The Frost Heart can definitely do some work against the Harganets. You know what? Let's do this. I think we can do this. Oh shit, they had a dragon. <laughs> Did I gloss past the dragon? Alright, well... Still, I think I think this can be okay still. I think this is pretty even. And uh, usually when it's even against the AI, we usually win. So let's set up like that, just nice and wide. Set you guys up back there. It's gonna be fine. I don't think we need to go super fancy or anything. These guys are gonna go around, hit the hit the archer back line. You can go and skirmish. You're gonna somehow fight a dragon, but I mean you're pretty good. I don't think you're dragon good, but you're good. At least I, if we do get the rebirth. Wait, oh you don't get the rebirth, do you? Oh you're a weird f frost phoenix that don't rebirth. Ah crap. <laughs> well that's not great. Oh well. Well we'll do what we can here. Let's uh, let's kite these guys. That's something we can do at the very least. Get in behind. And just pull these guys in. Oh, and if... I mean, if the dragon comes in on their own... Do you dodge that? No, not really. That hurts. <laughs> that hurts quite a bit. But yeah, I mean, if the dragon comes in on his own here... Maybe lands in the front line. We got Phoenix God right there. They're kind of made to kill dragons. Got Dread Spears distracted, which is also also pretty good. And we are getting some damage here. Alright, send in the Phoenix, I guess. See if they land in the front line here. Actually, let's hold off on the Phoenix until they land. Oh, are you gonna, are you gonna chase this Phoenix around? No, okay. You're going after the Lord. That is perfect. Yes. You're gonna get a little bit of damage. That's fine. We got lots of shooting. We got a Lord on him. We got... Uh, Phoenix guard on him. It's fine. So the dragon is down already. Very good start. Make sure he doesn't come back. Yep, shattered. Ignore him. We don't need to chase him because we are never gonna fight this again. So run around a little bit. Just shoot. And they do have a dark shard over here, but um, I'm not too worried about them. I'm worried about those. But yeah, that's a good start. Ow! Holy crap, Dark Shards. <laughs> that hurts a lot. That is one volley. Alright, you need to you need to run faster. You're not getting away from them very good. Alright, there we go. So hit there, hit there, hit there. 
and just ignore these red spares. There we go. That's fine. Let's get you in there. Let's get you to help. The executioners are rough. Let's get you in there, though. You should be able to help with the executioners. Taking a lot of damage from their shooting, but that's all right. How are we chilling them as we fly by? We are. Sweet. We have a nice debuff there, which is very nice. And I think we can terror route these. No, oh, they're immune to psychology, but we can route them at the very least. And we go in on their archers. Beautiful. So no more shooting for them. These guys are very routed. Let's send them into Dread Spears. Then we can... Um, we can terror route, though. Let's get the Swordmasters over there. Okay, send them over there in the Black Guards. That's gonna be fine. Let's focus everything on the Black Guards, actually. Everyone shoot Black Guards. Find the Black Guard and shoot him. It's like joining the Crips. <laughs> but elves. You wanna join the High Elves? Well, go out and kill a Black Guard. <laughs> Hit them in the rear. They are gonna break. No? Come on, that's one! <laughs> one leadership! <laughs> okay, there we go. Broken. Now you're running over the, those dark shards. Maybe go and hit those in the rear as well. Yeah, back off a little bit. Now we can line you back up because, well, I don't think they're coming back here. Go after the dread spares. Go after the dread spares. Go and hit those dread spares. They are very healthy, but. The Silver Helms are pretty good. And yeah, I don't think you're coming back, and even if you do, you're not really threatening anymore. So that's fine. So, yeah, I think we have definitely won this. There we go. Nice. Alright. So, grab a nice little chunk of money, and now we're fucking rich. So, start building that. Uh, you can go and... Uh, that is a lot of stuff. But it's pretty much all just uh, skeletons and zombies. I think we can take that. We are very healthy. And... Uh, oh, you don't have your dragon yet. And these don't come until level 20. Alright, that's fine. You don't have a garrison here, do you? No, because I don't want to fight that many things in a garrison. So, yeah, let's go and fight this. Oh, shit, it's him again. He's already back. He doesn't have his giant, though, which is nice. So, alright, let's fight this. Alright. Oh, it's this map. Okay, so you can either set up over here, which is usually very strong, but they're getting all of their reinforcements already up there. Although... It's just skeletons and zombies. How, how, how quick could they get there? Because you get this mountainside that is uh, really defendable. You get uh, high ground, which is really nice, especially with all of our shooting. And uh, you don't have to cover that much ground since it's pretty close to the wall. So yeah, I think yeah, we're just gonna we're just gonna set up over here. This is gonna be fine. And just do a loose formation for now, like so. We'll fix it. We'll fix it in post. Oh, dang it. Um, you should all be group one. There we go. You're all in group one, except for you, who is in, I don't know, group four. Three and five. Put you over there. So, let's uh, set up. Oh, that is too many units. Let's set up like so. Oh, god damn it. Okay, they're gonna be weird. That's fine. Set you up like that. Set you up there. And uh, let's see if we can lure this nerd up. This last time he was pretty eager to die <laughs> when, he, when we got him moving. So do we... No, we don't really have that great of a of a thing. So let's just let's just get our soul quenches on. Start shooting him. Maybe see if we go up real close. 
You wanna come and get some? Yeah, come get some. You're gonna be fine. Oh, did we get everything to move? Well, pretty much just the front line. Alright, well, let's lure him all over here. Oh, come on. There you go, come on. I know you wanna come over. Oh! Um, wow. Oh, I thought it was gonna be a good dodge, but it wasn't. There you go. Come on. Just leave your army behind and fight me on your own. <laughs> I promise, it's a great idea. It's this hot new thing that everyone does. No, no, come back. Dang it, dang it, come back. Come back, you piece of shit. Just, I just want to talk. There we go. Okay, run. <laughs> Okay, you, I guess, need to stay stand a little bit closer, just just to be enticing enough to for him to chase. Maybe, maybe just tease him with a little tickle. You can almost, you can almost taste it. Who can take it? Oh, and there's the bolt throwers. Oh, I never moved my archers though. Um, <laughs> go and shoot. Get him. Um, and land. Come on. Come here and fight. No? What? Okay, he's just turning around. Come on. I mean, I guess don't land. I can I can sit here and shoot at you for a while if you want to. Oh, he's attacking. Okay. Well, what is... Well, you took a big breath on one of our... Sea guards, but you are not having a good time here. Oh shit! Oh shit! Run! Okay, you can start moving up. I guess you can stay there because I completely forgot about you. But you are doing a good job, so it's fine. And you're actually pretty all right. Good. Well, so, get the archers in position. The fell bats are yeah, well; they're just gonna die here. All right, let's, uh, oh, you need that. Let's get the Helm of Discord, get the Disco Helm. Get a big flock of doom on everything that came on in. Yeah, Zacharias is going to die here though. Let's get a big heal though. Yeah, he's just gonna drain some in insignificant thing. It's not gonna do much. Oh, that's, that's not great though. All right, turn you around, turn everyone around here. Just Shoot the bar guys. They need to die. And yeah, they're going down real fast to shooting here. They, they can do a lot of damage, but they are also terrible, terrible. Uh, uh, well, they're not terrible. They are very much uh, glass cannons. So that's fine. You're still alright. Let's uh, turn these guys again so they can actually shoot what's coming on up. And yeah, we're all we're all right. These can raids uh, do need to die though, but we got magic damage on you, and we do need to heal these guys. There we go. So we got a vampire lord coming in. Oh, before I leave, let's explode them and blind them a little bit just to make sure they don't do any damage. And both of you can actually be in group 4, because now we're just gonna use you as a murder squad and uh, go and duel stuff. There you go. Um, do we have... We don't have Helmut Discord. Oh, but we do have Chain Lightning right there. Ah, oh, that's not actually... That's probably not gonna be very good, though. Or, or they are. If, if they just march in on it, then that is going to be really good. And yeah, they they just keep marching into it. Alright, that actually turned out pretty good. Let's get a big flock of doom right there. We kill the lord. Lots of damage on that. Um, yeah, okay. I just had to check that these guys weren't dead. Uh, we need some healing. Don't really have anything to drain, so that's fine. Let's blind everyone. And boop. Doesn't do a lot of damage, but it should debuff. Yeah, <laughs> that's zero. 
<laughs> they are zombies though, so that makes sense. Let's try to pull you back a little bit. Let's get you a heal though. Yeah, you just sit back and shoot now. This is most of the things. They are marching in slowly, but holy crap, they are... Okay, they're, <laughs> they're piling in here and really surrounding our, our guys, so... Let's get a heal on that. Let's get a chain lightning right there. That's gonna be nasty. We do really need to keep healing these guys though. And yeah, that should kill most of that. We can get a flock of doom on everything over here. Alright, that's pretty good. And they are marching into Lothern, so it's fine. It's not it's not like they're breaching the the well, it's not like they're breaching anything super important, because we still hold back here. It's just, uh, well, actually, maybe we should just pull them back. All right. Well, we can blind some stuff here, do a little bit of damage and blind. Let's keep healing our front line. These guys are holding like champs, though. So that's excellent. Oh, you're, <laughs> you're turned the wrong way. <laughs> Turn around, you dumb idiot. I mean, it's my fault, but still. What's the what's the point being the boss if you can't yell at your <laughs> your subordinates when they're not doing what you want them to, even though it's exactly what you told them to? Oh shit! Um, you got spearmen in. You actually walked all the way around, huh? All right. Um, let's grab both of the Illyrian archers and just uh, charge them into spearmen. It'll be fine. They're just skeletons. It's not. They're not that threatening. So just. Guard mode, keep shooting. You'll be fine. Um, uh, huge flock of doom right there. And I wish I had more chain lightning. And I wish I had um, fiery convocation right now. But uh, I guess... Uh, I guess we're just gonna have to do with this. We can still like Shem's burning gaze down lines and stuff, so that's gonna be fine. They're pushing in through our front line, but uh, like I said, we still have the secondary line of Lotherns, so we are perfectly fine here. And uh, yeah, they are racking up kills. Let's get a heal on you. And 10 seconds, so we're gonna pop that again. Just keep healing our front lines and our characters yeah everyone is nice and healthy we blind this entire blob do a little bit of damage oh and debuff them all down to zero <laughs> perfect all right you need to get out of there let's grab a couple of these and just turn around and shoot uh, you should be spread shooting and probably shooting like try to shoot over there just hitting blobs you could shoot this but uh, it should be fine now that we're shooting at it instead of sending in cab I guess I overestimated the cab oh these are grave guards oh crap well we can shoot some missiles down the line Loosh. Ah, uh, one missed. But we get some good damage there. And explode. Sploosh. Heal you up. And I think that is starting to be army losses. Beautiful. Okay, that was a sweet battle. And that should give us our dragon. And uh, depending on how many levels we get here. We are definitely going to start leveling towards Fiery Convocation, because that would have been so good here. Got to keep a couple of things, but that's fine. So, we got two levels. Excellent. We will reclaim our treasures. And there's our big chunky dragon. So, let's grab... Um, oh, we haven't even leveled this. Alright, make it cheaper. Make it, uh, make it uh, recharge faster. And we need one more, so I guess Tempest for when... We should have gotten Tempest a while ago since we're fighting vampires. Yeah, that would have been really good. 
<laughs> you know what? Let's uh, grab one of each because I would like to have Tempest available because it's really good. And then we work towards Fiery Convocation. Go on. And you just, you just need to be tanky. Sitting there doing a lot of damage. Well, two, two diplomatic la- Why is it two? Can it at least be five or something? I mean, I get that if you have a lot of nobles, it gets a lot, but... So what? <laughs> this is just dumb. It's so low. I wish these were all, these were all higher. But ports, we have a couple of ports. We have some industry, we have some entertainment. I mean, I guess... I guess just do the ports. We have a lot of ports, we have a lot of trade. Let's go with that. It doesn't really matter, the numbers are so, so low that I don't think it's that big a deal anyway. Let's get better scales. Oh, and I bet a lot of my caravans... Well, okay, one of our caravans finished. The other one is coming in next turn with another 10,000. Very nice. Alright, so we can definitely spend some money on Western commodities. No, actually, we, are, we do have a lot of Western commodities coming in. In that case, I think we're gonna try and get a lot of Eastern commodities. And yeah, we're gonna send you. Or, no, nah, let's get uh, Eastern Commodities. Send it to these guys. Just 2k for 200. It's pretty good. I'm gonna go with that. So, dispatch. And we're gonna have lots of commodities. And now we get some, some good shit that I'll probably give to you if you need them. But let's move you up and... Uh, Get some more sea guards. They're not the shielded variant, which is unfortunate because uh, we have to get up here for it. But uh, the normal ones are fine. I don't like them as much, but they are still pretty good. No. So what do we want to do here? Do we do we just turn around? Or actually, their capital is over there. I think maybe you take this and then you just cross over and we'll deal with this side because I feel like they're gonna defend this more and this is probably gonna be a stronger garrison as well since that's their capital oh and they did go and settle that all right well I guess we are just getting uh, some money buildings there it's gonna be fine it's gonna rebel eventually actually this will stabilize on the lowest one but since we get this it's gonna stabilize here yeah so that's fine Let's go for that. This will stable or not stabilize. This is gonna rebel eventually. So we might wanna just tear this down to get an entertainment district. Yeah, and then it's gonna then it's gonna settle here eventually. So yeah, that's fine. Order. Apparently, mo we must restore order. So we're just gonna pass the turn. Oh, actually, we got lots of money. Calls. I feel like yours. Oh, hello, Gilt. I will set aside my studies for Look at you growing and securing this whole thing. Okay. So we can just completely focus on this because this should be entirely safe. Why are you killing the, the defenders? <laughs> Why are you killing the lizards? Oh, you dumb idiot. Well, they are going to like us, so that's good. Who else likes us? You want trade and you want that. Well, I don't think we can do that because uh, everyone seems to hate you. So I don't want to anger them because those are the people that we are going to be want to be friends with. So yeah, we're just going to keep murdering stuff. Pass the turn. I find talking to your kind most. Yeah, that's not going to happen. But I kind of need to end this episode here. Oh, Reichland is a regional power. Good for them. Very nice. But we're just going to send out another convoy. Actually, we're going to do that next turn because uh, 
I don't think... I don't think we want to get a fifth one. I like the four we have in rotation, because that way we get four stronger ones. If they're the ones that always goes around. So yeah, we're going to wait a turn and uh, send out Halar Convoy, who is very healthy. And we'll probably do it, probably for money. And that's going to be fine. So yeah, we have way more money than we need. Oh, and this finished. Excellent. We can get a Shrine of Asurium for, for tech. But I kind of really want some Silver Helms. Yeah. Yeah, uh, um, we're gonna get some Silver Helms so we can recruit some of that. Grab that and that. And um, yeah, we're gonna end this episode here. So next episode we're gonna go and attack this. But that should be an auto resolve. You, may you are going towards the Floating Gardens. And we got yes. another one here, but that's fine. Do not mistake me for a fool. So we might need to go and defend here. We can't reach that, but we can set an ambush here or somewhere. Somewhere we, where we have a good ambush. So yeah, we're going to end this episode here. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.